Hello everyone, welcome to Skillbell Tutorials. This is Arun here with Lifery 6.2 Development Tutorials, session number 9. In the previous session we have seen, we have created a, a, a render phase and in this session we are going to create an action phase uh, and, and we are going to submit a form to that action phase. So let me just uh, show you how you can uh, create an action method over the controller over here. You just need to right click the um, Java file and you need to go to the source, override and implement methods and in this place you will be able to see something called process action. You just override the process action you will see the process action will be coming uh, to your java file you, you, you can edit you can update your code over here first let me just um, try to uh, put some this out as usual my action executes okay so okay that's done now what i have to do is uh, on clicking of uh, a form i need to make sure my action phase is executing so in for that we have something called uh, portlet not sorry Yep, we can we have to create an action URL like portlet you, you need to you'll see portlet action URL and you have to assign this to a variable then let me just put my action and what what else uh, you, you can do is portlet parameter mvc path okay yeah mvc path and what you need to do is uh, you have to put a jsp name view dot jsp okay so uh, so the, what i'll get is i'll get an action url over here and i i can call that uh, i can use this uh, action url in my HTML form. So I'm going to write simple uh, HTML. So sorry, oops. I, I have to uh, give simple form over here. Okay, form action equal to what you can give here is you need to use the JavaScript lets and mention my action at this place and you have to put method equal to post that's it so your uh, form is ready I'm just going to put an uh, input uh, type equal to submit as well the a button which is a type of submit button okay so what what i am going to get is on submitting this button this action this wow controller action is expected to uh, load and uh, after that this render uh, method is also going to execute so that's what my plan is let me just try giving that deploy So now my portlet deployment will start in a few seconds. Yes, my portlet is available for use. Okay, my my portal is actually uh, expired. It's session. I need to log in again.
but as i have created the public pages and this um, the this spotlight is on uh, public site uh, it doesn't matter whether i am uh, whether i am creating whether, whether i have logged in or not so still uh, i have to show you after logging in that that's why i logged in so the render uh, is executed there is no action phase uh, execution happened as of now now let us submit this let us see you see my action executes and then the render view executes again if you submit that what happens again your my action executes and the render executes so the, this is i have created a form and submitted that that action phase is executing and rest of the port let's render phase is executing so now let us see now i am going to create a post new thread test and test again now what i am expecting is when i click on publish only the action phase of the uh, message board portlet should execute but the wow life report let's action phase should not execute so that's what going to happen when i click on publish you see here only the render phase of your your newly created wow life reportlet is executed there is no action happen and also now click on this submit you see you see the action phase of your uh, uh, portlet is executed but the next portlet the message board portlet render phase only executed so th that is what happened when you do an action phase and um, a render phase and uh, that's all for this session and in the next session we will be learning how to pass data in between that is the data in between the form data to the controller and how you will make use of that and also we will be uh, learning some crude operations using the service builder in the upcoming sessions thank you for watching skill bell tutorials keep supporting us thank you again